Assalamu alaikum everybody, hope you guys are well inshallah ta'ala. When we hear the question, what is the miracle of Rasulullah sallallahu What's the most common answer here? Most of us we say the answer is the Quran. We simply respond it's the Quran itself. However, that's actually half the miracle. The miracle of the Quran is the fact that it transformed those Bedouin Arabs who used to kill their daughters, worship idols into this amazing generation of companions. When we tap into this miracle, again, a lot of us, we recite the Qur'an as a habit, recite the Qur'an for the, sake, for the basis of reciting, we're not transformed by it, we transformed by the Qur'an. The Qur'an has to change us. If it doesn't change us, then it becomes another book on our shelves that doesn't really impact us deeply. To tap into that transformative power of the Qur'an is to look into your life and areas you need to improve on and see what the Qur'an say about those areas. A personal example, when I had my first child, I asked myself, where can I learn about parenting from the Quran and Sunnah? And I realized that the answer was, the answer was in Surah Luqman, when Luqman السلام, tells his son all those, all those advice and realized, if I can teach my child that, then I've done my parenting job well. Try to interact with the Quran. Try to see that it is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala speaking to you and that should transform you and change your life. So this Ramadan, try to engage the Quran on a whole new level. In addition to your recitation, yes, you should recite as much as the Qur'an, but try to do more than that. Look into areas of your life that you're struggling with, for example, places you find challenging, and ask yourself, where does the Qur'an help me overcome this challenge? Or as you're reciting, just recite with that viewpoint in mind that Allah is speaking to me. Where, you know, what is He trying to tell me? We really, really hope that all of us can get transformed by the Qur'an, realize the power of the Qur'an in changing our lives into more productive human beings, inshallah ta'ala. Like I said before, the Productive Muslim team is here to hear your stories. Want to hear your stories, how the Quran transformed you either this year or previous years. If you go to this link, it will give you a clear explanation of how to submit your stories and what the campaign is about, inshallah ta'ala. You can even read some amazing stories from Productive Muslim team members worldwide on how the Quran transformed them. That's going to really, really inspire you. Our criteria is to tell us how the Quran inspired you to be more productive, socially, spiritually, or personally, and how it transformed you. You can send us photo piece, a essay, a video, four minute video, explaining to us how the Quran transformed you and we'll share with the world. The deadline for this is by the end of Ramadan. So try to send as many stories you want. Just share with the world how the Quran is transformative power. If you want a deeper relationship with the Quran, if you want to improve yourself and see the Quran have an impact on you, then join this campaign and be part of this campaign, inshallah. Tell your friends and family about it, share on Twitter, on Facebook. Let the world change and be transformed by the Quran and let them hear the stories, inshallah.